Okay, so another one of the questions that I got was, uh, talk more about the lore. Okay, so here's the deal. I will do some videos about the lore, but they're probably not going to be what you think, so you may not want to watch them. Uh, we'll see. Let's get real. I'm not one of these guys that's just going to read the lore to you and then talk about how awesome it is. They're great stories. Plenty of them are available in audiobooks and stuff like that. And you should listen to them and you should read them. And I'll be happy to talk about them. But all I'm gonna talk about is my opinion of them and of things that happen in them. Um, because I'm dyslexic. Uh, so trust me when I say me reading you the lore would be like the worst experience of your life. It would be like some type of strange torture from another country and you'd probably shoot yourself or me or, or one of the two. So I'm not going to put you through that. I'm not going to do that. Uh, but I will post some videos about my opinions of different lore and maybe some of the cool stuff that I got from it. And uh, so the first one will probably be Beowulf, which isn't necessarily lore so much as mythology, and, and, and but that's still folklore, and so we'll get into that. But anyways, it is my absolute positive favorite book of all time. It is my absolute positive favorite piece of lore and mythology, and so that's where I will start. And then uh, maybe we'll kick it to some of the other stuff that I think is cool.